Everybody, this is Beetle Five coming at you. We're on alone. One another. Blah. Yo, what is up, everybody? This is Beetle Five coming at you with another one of my reaction videos. I will be reacting to the Super Smash Brothers Ultimate Direct of Eight Eight. This, this has got to be something new. I, I really, I just no words. We all know Smash at this point. Here we fucking go. <laughs> new motherfucking character. Oh, what is this? Castle? Castlevania? <gasps> if it's Simon Belmont, I swear to God. Luigi! Oh, he's stuck in the mansion! Mummies! Jesus Christ! That's fucked up! Oh, Luigi! It's got... It's gotta be Simon Belmont. It has to be Simon Belmont. Oh shit. That's fucked up. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Luigi Christ, man. <laughs> Fucking Luigi's Mansion 3 is M rated. <laughs> Jesus. What the fuck? Oh my god. God! Took his fucking soul. What is this? It is. It's him. Simon Belmont! Yes! Oh my god! They really put in Simon Belmont! This is fucking amazing! I've wanted him for Smash for so long, I always thought he would be a great character! Oh, oh my god, this fucking scary ass Castlevania stage! <laughs> Holy shit! Oh my god. Dracula! Is it a cis trophy? <laughs> Holy shit. Oh my god. I cannot. Be gone. What? You Whoa! In this world, Richard! Are you two Simon? Two Castlevania characters? Unless, wait a minute. Is he? I'm pretty sure he's from Castlevania, but holy shit! Yeah, he is! But oh my god! Un. Believable. They just threw in two fucking Castlevania characters. Oh my god. Luosh. <laughs> That's fucked up. What the fuck? <laughs> that is fucked right up. You crazy I'm son of a bitch! Sora Limited. This is a follow-up to our recent announcement oh on Super my Smash Brothers god. Ultimate. Without further ado. Fuck. Oh my god. The legendary vampire I requested from the him Castlevania to... series, Simon Belmont, is finally I've joining I wanted him roster. to be in Smash for so long. He's been given a bit of a makeover. Yeah, way different. His signature item is, of course, his holy whip, oh the far-flinging vampire. Oh my god. Oh my god. It leaves you to attack, and it's a bit slow. But I think it's average reach during normal attacks. Oh yeah, his range is gonna be out of this world. He can move the whip freely. Oh, like Sheik used to be able to do with her whip. Nice. His special attacks are very recognizable. Oh wow. The axe. I mean, I don't, I don't really play Castlevania, but I've always known about him. Holy water. The cross in holy water. Putting that in a Nintendo uh -huh. game. Oh my god. While they may seem simple, they are very powerful. I like how the holy water water emits fire. <laughs> and his final smash is called Grand. That is so badass! Oh my oh my god! Dracula's cast! This is always a stage in like Smash Flash 2, and now we got it! The darkest stage. 
When an attack hits one of the candlesticks, an item will appear. Oh my god. In this stage, bosses from across the Castlevania series will rear their ugly heads. That is they frightening. They make Dracula's castle feel true to the world as they came. <laughs> the werewolf. Oh my god. Oh. And when speaking of Castlevania, you can't forget to mention the music. Oh For yeah, stage, Castlevania I know has really we music well tracks, recognizable music. New and classic tunes. Oh my god. The Castlevania series is very popular among our music team, I would imagine. and they were excited to work on these arrangements. Oh my god. Once in a blue moon, Simon's mortal rival will appear. Dracula. Look at this fucker. Oh man. <laughs> Dracula. Reborn every 100 years, he is eternally fated to wage war against descendants. Oh Roman. shit! You can't even do nothing to him! Oh my god! Under what conditions will he appear? Dude! Time will tell. Back off, fucking now, metal face and yellow devil. We got this motherfucker! Alucard! Alucard, son of Dracula, will lend his steel in battle. Oh wow. He wields the chrysogram, transforms into a bat, and dodges attacks by assuming mist form. He's very similar to his starring role in Castlevania Symphony of the Night. Like other assist trophies, he's susceptible to attack and KO as well. Nevertheless, he'll prove to be quite challenging. And we have one more fighter for you. Yeah, fucking richer. The vampire hunter who starred in classics like Castlevania Rondo of Blood Richter Belmont joins the battle. Richter Belmont. God damn. Richter is an echo fighter based on Simon. It's pretty much what I expected. Though his strength is the same, his look, voice, and animations all set him apart. Besides, the Super Smash Bros. Ultimate version of Simon can perform moves derived from Richter in his original games, so it's hard to say who's really echoing who. I <laughs> hope you'll enjoy the Guess that both. makes sense. Oh, their logo! Oh! I'd like to introduce two more Echo Fighters from completely different series while we're on the topic. Four characters! We're getting four characters! Oh boy. Fire Emblem? Crumb! We finally got Crumb! Yeah! Oh! An Echo of Mar- of- No, not of- No, of Ike! Yeah, he's an, he's an echo of Ike. Holy shit. <laughs> oh my god. Fucking crap. <laughs> this is beast. Look at all these motherfucking Fire Emblem characters. <laughs> oh boy. Nice. Look. Samus! Are you kidding me? No! No way! What? Oh my god! Dark fucking Samus! Oh my god, you look beautiful! No! Oh my god, I cannot believe they're doing this whole Echo Fighter thing, like, legit! Oh my god. I used to hate clothes, but I don't, I don't care anymore, man. Oh, and Dark Samus oh. joined the battle. Oh my. You may have seen this coming. Both fighters have been highly requested. Oh my god. They're each slightly different than the fighters they're based on, oh. so pick whoever you enjoy. Dude, look at Dark Samus, just a float. That is fucking As you can see, sick. Depending on your settings, you can either display all Echo Fighters separately on the Fighter Select screen or stack them with the fighters they're based on. I would do it when separately. Stacked, that way it makes it look like there's more in the game. I would I would want that feeling. This time, we plan to reveal the design of every fighter before the game launches. We'll have a few more to announce later, so stay tuned. More fighters? Dude, you're killing me here! For stages, we're mainly including. I've seen I've seen, I've seen all of these, we wanna know. Oh, living room, I haven't Allow seen that one, that was nice. Got a plane, nice, figure in circuit. Before. Flat zone X, look good, good, good stages. Oh, sweet, original Pokemon Stadium from Melee. Awesome. Can't beat that stage, it was a tournament, great day. Oh, Garden of Hope. It's a good, good Wii U stage. 
Oh my god, Brinstar Depths? Oh, look at Kraid! He looks so real now! Oh, I, I, I like this one. Nice. Summit from Brawl. It's a good one. We, I think I've seen that one, though. Oh, Brinstar Depths. That's, that's a real blast of the past. Oh, Unova Pokemon League. That's from uh, the, the 3DS. It's a cool one. Freaking Reshiram and Zekrom. Magic Hand, of course, they were gonna include this one. It was like a fan favorite stage. Goodness. Gamer. Nice. God, this game is actually really fucked up <laughs> with the mom and everything. Oh boy. Fi oh my god, look at this final destination. It is being torn apart. That is sick. It gets cooler every time. New Dock City Hall! I, I, I knew they would include a, an Odyssey stage. Ah, oh, that's nice. Oh, and it's like Delfino Plaza and uh, the Prism Tower. It's like a move around. Oh. Oh, there's one of the players. Oh, oh. What, oh, what happens if you activate Pauline? Oh, plays the song. I fucking love this song. <laughs> I'll be your one up girl into enhancing the look of the stages and rebalancing them. Fountain of Dreams is beautiful. That said, for stages that are originally here in the Nintendo 64 game, we prioritize nostalgia. You could change it if you want to look 64 or HD. It's turning out to be pretty impressive. Oh my god. That's beautiful. What is this? Oh. Now the total number of stages is, voila, 103. <laughs> we must be crazy. If we exclude Battlefield, Final Destination, and Big Battlefield, we'd have exactly 100. But take a look at the stage select screen. Oh Every my! Can also be transformed. God! Field and Omega form. So the total number of stages Holy! Is actually more. This is a mod. This is a fucking mod. All this cannot be real. It really can't. This is the shit that I would mod on Brawl for like Smash Bros. Plus and fucking Smash Bros. Infinite. Where it was like over a hundred characters and fucking a hundred stages. This is fucking ridiculous. Select this option for a less chaotic experience. Oh my god! I cannot also, believe this game! Matches the order in which they were introduced in the series, just like the fighters. Oh my god. This is unfucking real. Stages, we have a little surprise. Please take a look. Oh, why? Brinstar, nice! Excuse me, what? Check that out. While playing, the stage can Just transform around you. Guy left! But first, you must select the stage morph option. Stage Then, you can pick two stages on the stage select menu. Oh my... Stages you like and have fun. God! That is awesome! That is so cool! I can't fucking... For the player who wants it all, my music lets you select well, yeah, this tracks for each stage. Can't exclude this. This, this is stupidly is important in Wii U. I put, ow, this was important in Brawl. I put all my favorite music for this one. Until now, each stage had its own set of music tracks. But this time, the tracks are organized by series instead. For example, oh. as long as you're playing on a stage based on the Legend of Zelda series, you can pick any of the tracks included from that series. That's kind of cool. I like that. Now for the total number of music tracks from Oh, don't even fucking tell me, dude. You you exaggerated the number on Wii U. No. My god. Oh, my. Oh, oh. More than 800 tracks. And if we count other types of music, like menus and fanfare, then there's actually about 900 compositions. If you played them all in a row, you're a madman. You know this. Shopping, there's more than 28. Hours you know that you are a madman for what you are creating right now. These game franchises are a big part of. You're gonna game break the gaming the world as we know it. Of memorable music, all of this packed into one game. This in itself is extraordinary. Oh my god. Of course, there's a sound test menu as well. For your browsing pleasure, we've sorted all of the tracks by game series. Oh my god. 
It's like having an album for each series. If a track has no corresponding fighter or stage, or if I can't get over the Castlevania and logo. It can be Just a fucking the fucking castle with a bat. <laughs> oh my god. You can create your own playlist too. Sort them in any order you like, anytime, what? as much as you want. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Oh god, what is this now? In handheld mode, you can play music while the screen is turned off. You were able it's to do that too like with the uh, 3DS, Switch so that was that was kind of cool. That's I do like that. Da, da, da. A huge that, variety that's of handy. music has been collected for the game, and you can sample some of these tracks. Galaga melody. Jesus. We're planning to add selections basically every week, so please stay tuned. Oh boy. What rules? There are no rules some when you fucking add Simon Belmont to this game! I'd still like to show you some things about the multiplayer battle rules. Oh god. Now the first thing you will select is the rules. If you create your own rule set, you can immediately begin playing with those rules at any time. Okay. In addition to time battle and stock battle, stamina battle is now treated as one of the standard smash modes. Is it There's now? A different I was never a big fan of stamina. These battles. Oh wow, they, the corpses blow up when they're done. Normally in stamina battle they would just lie there. You could kick them around and ragdoll them. This time, stage selection comes before fighter selection. Which this is really gonna throw me off. On how well that's that's gonna be real stage. trippy to pick a stage before the, last battles, loser pick the, next stage before the characters. In sudden death, you not only start with 300% damage, and but the, the camera screen will fucking zooms zoom in. No more, this no more bombs. A nice sense of urgency. Oh god. Oh. Oh wow. Final smash meter. Chargeable final smashes are now a selectable option. Oh. During a match, your final smash meter will fill, and then once it's maxed out. Oh, cool! It's like Shrek Super Slam. <laughs> I can't believe I made that reference. Jesus. When you apply this option to a match, things can get really flashy. Uh, that's kind of cool. That's no way that will be tournament legal, but that's kind of cool still. I like that. By the way, no two final smashes will happen simultaneously. Wow. I like that. There are other additions to the battle modes, too. Squad Strike? We've added in Squad Strike. It's a five on five or three on. Three oh, it's like fucking battle. group Side play. Battle. Each player will use five consecutive fighters in one battle, but it might be fun for multiple players to. Yeah, it's battle. just it's just like it's just like group play fucking in, in a also local tournament. Tourney mode. Oh my god. Choose the number of players. Oh, tournament mode is back! I'm so glad they don't have that in Wii U. Oh, I love doing this in melee. 32 players can join the tournament, so it's great for parties too. Oh boy, smash down! We're adding a special smash mode. Yo, hold on! I just have to click pause real fucking quick. Let's just baffle in the glory of this, please, because I'm losing my motherfucking mind right now. I cannot, Billy. That we got Dark Samus, Krob, and Simon Belmont and Richter. I can't fucking believe they did this. Oh wait, Krob is a clone of Roy, not Ike. Oh okay, but Jesus Christ, we got. Let's we'll see, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, sixty-seven characters. Actually, two if you count the Me Fighters. So that's 69, and the two other Pokemon, 71 characters total. 70 fucking one characters. Best game. That's it. Just, just, Smash it's, just, it's just this. After a battle in this mode, the previously selected fighters will no longer be available to use in the next battle. Oh. So each player must select a different oh. fighter. It definitely pays off to be skilled with multiple Soccer, fighters. Soccer, I really paid you attention to what to what tournament guys are just making up in the terms of their own can. rules for the game. He really did pay attention. This is what we fucking do in our tournaments. The new training mode will feature an exclusive stage. <laughs> On a graph chart? A grid, so it's easy to measure distance and more. A, oh my god! 
What a grid! You can also display launch distance. What? The red line predicts your trajectory. At oh my god, he damage, really. And the blue line is. He's really on damage. board with the whole competitive scene that the community has made for this the game. Is this is all shit that people care so. I mean, I don't read so deep into this because I'm only mildly competitive, but. This is so what people care about. The single player mode in which players battle oh, against Oh, they fight Master Hand. Gotta love it. Oh. Each fighter has a set series of stages and opponents they will face. Nice. Can't be classic. Awesome. Now, let me introduce you to some new items, Pokemon, and assist trophies. Okay. I don't really know Pokemon anymore because I'm fucking. A banana gun? A banana gun! Yeah, that's pretty much how I feel. <laughs> a fucking banana gun. You're insane. You, you, what crack are you sm killing? Edge? Whoa! Bobber from Kirby. Not killing you. That's pretty good. What the fuck? Damn sight! This is violent shit for fucking Smash Brothers! Staff all, all this fucking Castlevania stuff! This is terrifying. This is fucking terrifying! Rambly Evil Shroom reverses. Oh, reverse controls. Rage Blaster? Oh my god. Why oh, do we get all these scary weapons? Okay, I don't- I've not played Sun or Moon, so I don't really know newer Pokemon anymore. Oh, um, Executor, the, the- the newer version! Oh, that's cool, he acts as a- as, as a platform! That's neat! <laughs> Abra? I know him. Oh, he TPs ya, that's fun. <laughs> that's amusing, I like that. Oh, he's the legendary from Sun. That's cool. Whoa, Christ! That's the legendary from Moon. Oh boy, whoa! Mimi Q! Whoa! Well, he's just dead. His soul has just been devoured. Holy crap, it is! Whatever that is, that thing. Kicks your ass if you go near it. Nice. Vulpix and the uh, Ice Vulpix. Cool, cool. It's neat. Whoa, what the? Marshadow. Aren't you adorable? Ditto! That's so funny. Ditto was like the rarest Pokemon you could ever get in Melee. And, you would, and this is what it would do, but oh, wow. Back that. What? Oh, zero! <laughs> I'm like. <laughs> that is fucking zero. Nice! Oh, badass, man. Dude, Zero's super cool. He would have made a good character. Knuckles. Alright. Damn. It's it's so weird that these guys are almost actual fighters. It really feels like they are. Crystal from Star Fox Adventures. It really feels like they're may as well be care. Oh, Claptrap from Donkey Kong Country. Aw, Cap'n! I love him with his little bus that just fucking drives you away. <laughs> Chef Kawasaki! Oh, he's a great lovable character from Kirby. Oh, Gray Fox, of course. Very deadly assist trophy in Brawl. What a Nikki. Oh, that's cute. Shovel Knight! I bet most people are pissed about that, that he's not a character. <laughs> Oh boy. Oh my god, the Majora's Moon! <laughs> Holy shit! Holy shit! <laughs> no! <laughs> That's fucking terrifying! And Shovel Knight lives. All of them can Ashley be and special guests. Bomber Man! Just arrived. What is this trophy now? They're cock blocking us with. Huh? Monster Hunter? From the Monster Hunter series, Rathalos swoops in. My God. 
Holy crap! What? Here's as a boss. A boss? On on a stage? Oh no! Is it a assist? Can also show up as an assist trophy. Oh my god! Actually, he's the first character to appear as both. Oh my god! That's fucking crazy! Jesus Christ! Before we go, I'd like us to take a quick look at the main menu. Please. Nothing would satisfy me more. Beautiful. Oh, what you got down the bottom left corner there, Sakurai? What you hiding? As you can see, there's a mysterious mode here. But we can't talk about that just yet. Also, there's a dashboard on the right side of the screen. Ah. This can be accessed at any time by pressing the ZR button. Options and control descriptions are listed here as well. God. That's all for today's announcement. The entire development team is putting all of their energy into finishing the game, so please be patient until launch day. What the fuck is that? Thank you so much for watching. What? What is? Th what is this? Sakura, you fucking tease. What is this? Villains. Please be who I think it is. Attention. What? What was that? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh! 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 <laughs> oh. oh my god. This is madness. <laughs> Got a fucking berry ability. Oh my god. Oh my god! Oh my god! Look at all these beautiful characters. Look at all. Dark Sam. Fucking King K. Rule. <laughs> I cannot fucking believe this. This is so real! Oh my god! Simon fucking Belmont. Oh god. That's, I just, I can't get over it. They, they're really putting in all these people. The only character that I ever so wanted badly to be in Smash, not because I like them or anything, just because, well, some of them I like them. Some of them I just thought deserved to make their spot in Smash Brothers. I always thought Pac-Man should be in Smash. I always thought Little Mac should be in Smash Brothers. I always thought Simon Belmont should be in Smash Brothers. I always thought that Bomberman should be in Smash Brothers. And I always thought that at least one Final Fantasy character should be in Smash Brothers. I didn't particularly care who. They picked Cloud. I'm like, okay, cool, Cloud. And Sora from Kingdom Hearts. Especially with what they're with the and no, they they should put Sora in Smash and with Sakurai paying attention. I also wanted the King Kingdom. I forgot. I also I also thought he would make a great addition to the game. Uh, I also thought that Lloyd from Tales of Symphonia would make a great addition to this game, but Sakurai's really paying attention to these requests with Simon Belmont and King K. Rule. So I hope for the near future that he actually does put in Sora. Because if he does, I will, 
I will shit my pants right here in this chair. <sighs> my God. Insane. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and leave a comment on the video to react to in the future. And I will see you guys next time. Laters!